Hello there. For those of you that don't know me, my name is Michelle Ferre. I am a fourth grade teacher in Maryland, and I'm also a sponsored FlexPass student at Capella University. Today, I wanted to discuss competency-based education, what it means, what it looks like, and how I'm able to apply it in the classroom as a teacher. My Master of Education in Teaching and Learning is competency-based. That means I have to demonstrate proficiency with specific knowledge, skills, and abilities throughout my courses. These competencies are directly related to the skills necessary for me to be successful as an educator. One example of a competency would be incorporating multicultural perspectives into curriculum, instruction, and assessment. Now, I am able to track my progress toward each competency for every course using my competency map. I am able to individually display each course, and then I can see the total number of criteria and assessments for the course. I can see a list for all of the competencies being assessed for the course, and I can see my progress toward each one. As I complete my assessments, the circle will fill with the color that matches my performance. For example, if I earn a score of distinguished, then the circle will begin to fill in a dark green color. I can even click on each competency and see which criteria I have already completed, and I can see what my performance was for each one. As a visual learner, the colors really help me understand my performance for each competency so that I can focus on the specific areas that I need to improve on. If I notice I'm not performing as well for a specific competency, then I know that I need to devote more time to researching and practicing the related knowledge and skills. Once I have demonstrated proficiency, then I know I'm ready to begin applying the knowledge and skills in my instruction. For example, once I demonstrated proficiency at integrating educational technology into teaching practice, then I was able to begin reevaluating the way I integrate technology into my classroom to make sure that it was transforming my lessons rather than just modifying them. I really hope that this explanation of competency-based education was helpful for you. If it was, please give the video a thumbs up. As always, if you would like more information on Capella's FlexPath format, you can use the links in the description box and I will catch you in the next one.